Are you ready? Let's go. Are you ready? Conversation. There's a cute spot. I do want to get a cute spot. Yeah. Yes. In terms of consistency, it's right to my toe. So that this one really is on me. Good morning, everyone. It's currently Tuesday. Um, we are leaving on our anniversary trip today. So I thought I would pick up the camera and start vlogging again, <laughs> just because I mean I haven't really been doing much lately. And so I haven't really been vlogging, but I just thought I went on a little trip. It's going to be really cute. It's for, we got a really nice Airbnb. I'm really excited. So I just thought, why not? And take you guys along our little anniversary trip. We make three years. It's crazy that we've made three years already. Um, we got married in March 29th, 2020. So right the beginning of pandemic. Anyways, um, I'm gonna get ready. I'm gonna curl my hair, do my makeup, and then I have to pack. Um, and then I have to pack this up for my doggies because they're coming with us. Oh yeah, side note, I also did my hair or got my hair done um, by my friend. I really like it. Um, she has to do the back next time because the back doesn't have as many highlights. <laughs> But, I mean, I like how it came out. Um, it's really nice for summer. I really wanted a more bright look. And everyone keeps telling me it looks good. Like, it looks better than my dark hair. Which is good. It's a good thing. So, now I know that 
lighter hair works better on me than dark hair good to know so i've been using this uh paula's choice two percent bha liquid exfoliant if you've never tried this you need to try it that stuff has helped my skin so much like it's clear up a lot of my little acne and i really like it um first time you use it though it might make you it might sting a little bit but you have to get used to it but it feels so good i love this so my skincare at the moment is super basic <laughs> just because i tend to get really lazy when it comes to my skincare especially with a night if i get really t if i'm really tired i just want to do something really quick so honestly i just have four products that i always use um been using frequently um right now i'm using my murad retinol um renewal eye serum i've been really loving this i have seen a little bit of a difference once i started using this um it's not like major, but I do feel like it's made my under eyes less dark. And every time I put it on, it just feels so hydrating. My serum that I use is the Radiant Serum Complexion Correcting by Caudalie. Caudalie? I don't know how to pronounce it. I say Caudalie. Um, this is my second or third bottle, I think. I love this so much. It's cleared up a lot of like my dark spots and like pimple or like um acne spots and it's made my face super like clear and just I don't know it just makes it looks it makes it look super nice. Don't forget your neck. It's very important to put your skincare on your neck because you don't want a wrinkly neck. And I'm trying to do this just so. Try to get that jawline back, even though I've gained so much weight. You know? Anyways, moisturizer. I've been using the Laneige, Laneige Water Bank Blue Hyaluronic Cream Moisturizer. I love this moisturizer. Honestly, AC is a Tatcha one. And I love the Tatcha one. I love Tatcha, anything Tatcha. But it's a little pricey. I will say that this literally feels the same and it's way less than the tatcha moisturizer the um the water cream i mean the blue one or the green whatever color it looks like i call it blue but i may be wrong but yes very moisturizing this one's really good if you have oily skin um which i do because it's water-based and it doesn't make my face or my skin feel oily when I apply it, especially under my makeup. So for my sunscreen, I used to use the, I think it's called, I used to use this one, the glow screen. Um, I mean, I liked it, but I wanted to try something different and especially I wanted to try more Korean skincare because... I love anything Korean because I know their products are really good. So I started using the Innisfree Daily UV Defense Sunscreen. I love this. Um, it makes my skin feel and look super dewy. And it doesn't leave... It doesn't leave a white cast, which... That's what I love. Especially because I'm dark-skinned. Um, I don't want a white cast from my sunscreen and it has a very subtle smell so if you're sensitive to smell i think this one would be good for you because it's it has a little a little bit of scent it's not overpowering or at least to me at least as you can see there's no white cast and it makes my face look very dewy love it and then for my lip oil i use the morphe uh, Morphe 2 Glassified Lip Oil and Flutter. And I love this. Moisturizes my lips so much. Anyways, that's my skincare. I'm going to do my makeup really quick because I got to start packing and got to get things ready. And then I'll show y'all. I'll show y'all everything I'm going to try to take um, on my trip. Okay, 
finished my makeup, my hair, um, went super simple today. All I did was, um, my skin tint, my milk skin tint, my Say Beauty blush, mascara, my Laura Mercier powder, and then my Revolution, um, pout, um, lip gloss. So that's literally all I did. Um, just wanted to keep it super simple, super quick, especially because I don't really have time to be complicated. I've also been using this Evian facial spray and it's been really setting my makeup and kind of making me feel more dewy. I love it. I really love this. I got this at Marshalls, I think. I should have gotten two because I really love this and the smaller ones are super expensive and this one was like five bucks at Marshalls. So I'm going to go back and see if they have any more. Left her there. Which goes back to... That should be a little... Yeah. So Bernie and what? Happy with your speaker? Are you ready? Let's go. Are you ready? Let's say. simple, these type of houses.
grocery trip for like a day or two. We got some eggs. Um, I'm gonna make some huevos rancheros tomorrow for breakfast. So eggs with some potatoes for tomorrow and um, for the huevos rancheros I'm gonna do tomatoes and onions, chop those up. Um, and then for the meat, um, I just bought Spam, just because it's like the easiest thing. Next. We got some jarritos for um, little drinks. My husband brought tequila, so it's gonna be fun. Um, what else did we get? Oh, we got some Keurig cups for the Keurig maker. Um, chips. We got, this is my husband's, I don't like these. The jalapeno ones, and then my favorite. Um, some Cheetos, hot Cheetos. Um, got some little creamers for the coffee and for a little bit of sweetness because I, I, I have a sweet tooth. I got some blueberry muffins. So I'm excited for these for the morning, my coffee.
to head out. I don't want to leave yet. I really love this place. Honestly, I'm probably going to come back. We're going to try to do this every, at least once a year. So I'm going to hopefully to get this cabin or the other one over there that's a little bigger, but it's still really pretty. So yeah, I really enjoyed it. It was so nice. It's been like so relaxing. I feel like I've been able to like really be in the moment and enjoy it. It's not even vlogging, but really not be on my phone and enjoy, which has been nice and spending time with my husband. So it's been super nice and the girls have loved it so much. So I'm sad to go, but ready to go back to life. Gotta head back, get back into the routine, but it's okay. Anyways. Their eyes are so funny. <laughs> 